Oh boys, it's been a couple of days since I've done a little video here, and um, put a little comment up there yesterday about a little treat that uh, I have in store for you tonight. Well, it's going to be tonight, but uh, it's a piece of test equipment that was donated to me Friday evening, and. Uh, it does have, you know, an issue or two that hopefully, maybe together we can uh, do something with it. Perhaps we can make it work. Hopefully. Parts of it do work, but uh, actually the majority of it do work, as far as I can tell anyway. But, it's a uh, piece of test equipment that, uh, you know, that you can test radios with. It's a piece of test equipment that, you know, that most certainly needed for, uh, you know, technical repairs of radios and receivers and stuff and, uh, and whatnot. And, uh, well, without further ado, here she be. Ain't that a beauty? It's a Motorola R2200 Communication Service Monitor and Spectrum Analyzer. How cool is that? This is cool as it gets, I think. Um... Spectrum analyzer part, the receiver part of it works. I got a little ligator clip put on here. As you can see, I just touch. It does. It does work. That's the uh, scope. Spectrum analyzer. I downloaded the uh, the technical manual, their owner's manual, and I've also downloaded the troubleshooting uh, maintenance manual for this test set so basically the part that ain't working or working but not you know very well um, you have this connector it's an end type connector it's an RF in and out right here the uh, I already tried using this on uh, transmitting with the uh, with the radio here, and um, it does the input part of it for transmitting. It do show the uh, the power level of the radio, no problem. And uh, the maximum amount of RF power you can dump into this thing is 125 watts of RF power, and um, yeah. So I am literally, literally, just trying to understand this thing, but uh, <laughs> it's a beast, to say the least, and she is worth her weight in gold. No repair bench is, uh, you know. I have to thank uh, uh, the person for donating this uh, spectrum analyzer service monitor to me. You know who you are, and I'm sure you are watching, and I'd like to thank you very, 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 very much. So, hopefully together, we'll uh, get this thing uh, up and running 100%. Um, like I say... Power input works, displays power here, no problem. Now if I try to generate a signal into, say, said radio, a 146.52, which I just punch in, I'll punch it in anyway, 146.5200, enter, and I put this thing on gen or even high gen, Generate. 
you can hear it. So change frequency again because it changed here. But you notice nothing on the radio. So no matter what position I put the either high gen or gen generate high generation or generation it uh, the radio doesn't uh, receive a tone so that's the issue I'm having with this thing in power monitor position I can key the radio and you'll see a power level over here in watts yes 4.61 watts that's because I have the radio set to low one so there we have it Motorola R2200 so if anybody has any experience with these uh, service monitors out there in YouTube land and uh, you're familiar with the uh, Possibly or even ran into the issue with the RF in out Well at least for generating the signal out Please comment below. I would definitely want to hear from you If you've worked on these before But boys isn't she a beauty She is a lovely 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 critter Run down along her so you can see everything. See all the lovely controls and whatnot. Anyways, if anybody out there has worked on these uh, uh, test sets and have run into the issue with the RF in out section, please let me know. Let's see if we can't uh, get this thing up and running 100%. Anyways. Sorry for uh, keeping me in suspense there for a while, but I figured, uh, you know, this is uh, well worth the wait. She is a lovely, lovely, lovely critter. Hey folks, thanks for watching. And uh, you'll be seeing a lot more of this, uh, of this beast in the days, weeks, and months ahead. All the best, folks. Chat later.